Texas Target Practice is a spiraling review of the Texas Essential Knowledge and Skills for Texas teachers. In fact, Texas Target Practice is not for sale or use outside the state of Texas. Teachers love the preview, practice, and review that Texas Target Practice provides in an easy-to-use format that takes approximately 10 minutes a day. Students feel confident when using the program because of its familiarity and consistency. Parents like that their children are improving their math understanding as well as their scores. To open the program, navigate to digital.lonestarlearning.com, then enter the credentials you were sent by email. Look in your dashboard for Texas Target Practice, then click the Use Program button below it. Upon opening the program, you will see a bar at the bottom of the screen with five buttons. The Printables button will open the printable materials. The Progress Chart button will download a spreadsheet version of the class progress chart. The License button will give you the License Agreement page. Tutorial will run the step-by-step -step tutorial in the program. And the Exit button will close the program. One of the most integral parts to Texas Target Practice are the printable materials. These materials include directions for use, teaching tips, an answer key, correlations to the Texas Essential Knowledge and Skills, progress charts, and student think sheets. In the program, there are 10 colors for the 10-day rotation of the program, each with 18 sets to use throughout the year. These color sets are labeled by week and by day for your convenience. Each color set contains information that the students use to create the questions on their student think sheet. Now, let's see how the program works. The program consists of 36 weeks broken up into sets of 10 colors. Each set of 10 colors contains two weeks worth of material for the students to use. Within those colors are multiple questions labeled by letter. These letters align with the printed and digital student think sheet in order to create the questions students will answer. These questions can be viewed at the bottom of the screen when the button labeled student sheet is clicked or they can be found in the printed think sheet located in the printable materials. There are a few ways for students to answer the questions. The first is to display the think sheet within the program by clicking on student sheet in the toolbar at the bottom of the screen. Students can fill in their printed think sheet as the class answers the questions with the drawing tools on the interactive whiteboard. You can then choose to display all the answers using the answer button or show individual answers by clicking the letter on the color set. Students can then check their answers against those on the screen. After answering, you can discuss the answers as a class. This is the preferred option until students are familiar with the program and the text that are being addressed. Another option is to not display the think sheet found in the program and to have students answer questions associated with that day's color on the printed think sheet only. This is a great option once students are familiar with the program and its contents. There are two versions of the printed think sheets provided in the printable materials. A short two-page version and a four-page version with extra space for students to show their work. When answering questions, you may want your students to work with partners instead of individually each day. On the first day, click the Set 1 Gold Monday button. Students will then answer all questions associated with the gold color sets. On day two, move on to the Set 1 Red Tuesday button. The students can then answer all the questions associated with the red color sets. Students will use a new color each day until they have moved through all the set one colors in 10 days. After 10 days, one cycle of the program has been completed, and the students have previewed, reviewed, or practiced all the Texas Essential Knowledge and Skills for their grade level. On the 11th day, begin using the colors listed beside the set 2 title. The cycle then begins again, and students use the new Set 2 information to answer the same questions. Each set will be cycled at the end of 2 weeks until you have used all 18 sets at the end of 36 weeks. Because the student thinks she always stays the same, and only the information on the color set changes, students feel confident in their answers and enjoy using Texas Target Practice. Because Texas Target Practice covers all the text for your grade level, your students will likely not know how to solve all the questions at the beginning of the school year. You may choose to skip those questions until that concept has been taught, but most teachers choose to use this as the preview of your concepts. A short explanation and answer can be given for these questions until that concept has been fully taught. We suggest that each day after students have completed the color of the day, that time is allotted to discuss answers 
and to use those teachable moments to reinforce concepts students are having difficulty learning. The program has many tools to work through with your students, depending on the grade you're using, such as a protractor, fraction comparisons, a notepad for annotating, counting tiles, and a 0 to 99 chart. These tools can all be found in the toolbar located at the bottom of the program. All grade levels have Think About It's, which are helpful resources for students. They are included for every activity in the color sets. You can access them by clicking on the light bulb located at the top right hand corner of the color set. This will bring up a list of letters. Press the letter of the activity you want to display. The Think About It will then be displayed on your screen and you may move and resize it. You may want students to bring a pocketed Brad folder to keep their student think sheets and scratch paper organized. To save paper, put the think sheet in a pocket protector and laminate it, then place it in the Brad folder. Have students fill in the answer with a grease pencil. At the end of each two week period, erase and reuse. Notebook paper can be kept in the pockets for students to work the problems, or students can use the long version of the printed think sheet with space for students to show their work. For organizational purposes, we have also included two versions of the progress charts to assist you and your students in record keeping. These can be used in a variety of ways. Put students' names down on the left-hand side of the class progress chart. When you observe students who need additional assistance in a particular concept, check their names. The check names can become your tutoring groups when you tutor on that concept. The student progress chart can be used by the student and placed in their Texas Target Practice pocket folder. On this form, students use green for go, I understand, and yellow for caution, I might need to work on this concept some more. When students have methods of tracking their own progress, they tend to take more responsibilities for their learning. Also included is a class progress chart spreadsheet that can be accessed by clicking on the progress chart button at the bottom of the program. This spreadsheet allows you to track student progress digitally by checking the boxes with either a Y for yes or N for no. This can be kept digitally for easy access. Texas Target Practice is a versatile and powerful program. It can be used each day to start your class and can even be used as a center or sponge activity. And the use of color in the program not only indicates the daily pace of the program, the association of concepts with color significantly improves student retention and recall. When students are doing practice problems, we often hear them make comments such as, oh, this is like red A. Give your students the power and confidence they deserve by using Texas Target Practice.